Hi friends, it's Lisa Hetrick from Indigo Jade Art and I'm so grateful you could join me today for this color mixing video using quinacridone rose and quinacridone gold. I call them the Quinnies. So we're going to have a little bit of fun, mix mash these two brands together and see what we can create. So I'm using my favorite watercolor paper for swatching and mix testing, and that's the watercolor paper from the Bee Paper Company. I have quinacridone gold here from Sennelier. I love this brand. Um, I'm showing you here the different pigments. So this quinacridone gold in this brand is made up of these three pigments. Um, it's not a single pigment color, but it's a delicious color to use for mixing, and I love it. And here's the M. Graham Quinacridone Rose, and this is a single pigment color, PV19. So I've got four pigments here that I'm kind of playing with and mixing up since the three pigmented quinacridone gold from Sennelier and then the one pigment in the Quin Rose from M. Graham. But I'm going to get wild and have some fun with it. And I really love these experiments to see what you can create. And that's the whole purpose of these color mixing videos to get your paints out and play with them. So. I'm going to go ahead and swatch out the quinacridone gold here in the Sennelier. And I love this brand and I love this gold. Now, I have quinacridone gold in a couple other brands and I love them too because I love all the things. But this color is just really, really nice and I love to use it in my flowy, flowy florals. So, and that's what I'm sharing today. So I cleaned up my brush and I've got the quinacridone rose in the M. Graham and I'm kind of doing both of these colors at full strength so you can get a good look-see at what they look like. And alone, they are gorgeous. So now I'm just going to take a little bit of the color and put it on my, um, porcelain plate here that says vibes because we got color vibes today and just take a little bit of the rose and put that separately as well just a little puddle of each color so that I can begin to dab in a little bit of each color in the opposite and just kind of mix so I've taken a little bit of quinacridone rose here and put it in with the gold so a little bit of rose a lot of gold and I'm going to go ahead and paint a leaf and you've get that kind of heavy on the rose side got a little bit of gold tint in there and I'm really really digging this so this technique is one of my favorite things to do for flowy florals and painting florals so that you can get some two-tone color here I'm not necessarily mixing the two together I'm kind of using both and that's just one fun way to do some color mixing. And I'm adding more rows to that gold and letting those mix a little bit more. So you see in this third version here, it's got a little more gold mixed in to the rows. So there's definitely no um, difference. You can't see the difference between the two colors within the one image. So a lot of gold here on the tip of my brush and I'm dipping it into the rows and just doing another mix to kind of see what that's going to look like. And I just love the flexibility of this. So more gold mixed with the rose, and we've got a little bit of a different tone here. Now there's four different looks here with the same two colors. And I could do this all day and come up with like infinite looks here with these two colors. So that's the whole point of these color mixing videos is for you to experiment with the colors that you have or these two colors if they're in your stash and see how many combinations you can create. You can see I'm going back and forth here and dipping into the rose and the gold and varying the amount of paint that I have on my brush to kind of create that little flower. And just adding some more. So I've got a lot of rows here. And I'm just going to get a little tiny bit of the gold on the tip here. And this is another way to load up your brush so that you get lots of concentrated color in the brush, but a little bit of gold or the alternate color in the tip so that you can do some really fun color mixing. And I am loving the way these two colors have become friends together. 
I hope you enjoyed this little mashup of Quinacridone Gold by Sennelier and Quinacridone Rose by M. Graham. I love these colors and I hope you enjoyed today's color mixing tutorial. Thanks so much for joining me. Please consider sharing the joy by liking this video and subscribing to this channel. And if you are interested in taking a watercolor class with me online, visit with me at craftyourjoy.com. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.